Hey, I'm Wade. Painting is my passion and art is my life. It took me around a couple of days to make sketch feel alive. I used to upload my sketches on Facebook. Within no time, I started getting likes and comments of my friends admiring the art. There was an unknown girl who liked my sketch and also texted me. I looked up her profile but I didn't find pics of her. She texted me again that I love your sketches and big blushing smile came to my face. We chatted for a while, she asked me that I wanted to see your sketches and I said, okay, come to my place. Hey, I'm Aradhya. I'm here to see Ved. Gorgeous. Sorry? No, I'm in here to see Ved. Oh. Nice to meet you, Aradhya. Hello. Come on in. Please have a seat. This is for you. Thanks. Aradhya? Hmm? This is my word. It's so beautiful. I know. Tea? Coffee? <laughs> Or should I ask for a fi? Coffee will be fine. Okay, just wait for a sec. Yeah. Hey, can I ask you something? Sure. Where's your family? I don't have family. Oh, I'm so sorry. Thank you. Do you miss them? You know, hmm? let me show you something. Come with me. What is it? Just come. Okay. Aradhya, hmm? this is my secret place. Usually I come here when I feel alone. When I miss mom and dad, I just watch the stars and try to talk with them. Without family, this house no longer feels like home. Hey, listen to me. Now onwards you never ever feel alone. That's my promise. Listen, hmm? do you think if it would be okay if I ask you out, maybe sometimes? Yeah, maybe. Okay, okay. Maybe I will. Most of the time we used to spend together, I was really into her and so was she. One day I told her to meet me that I have a surprise for you. You know, sometime we'll meet someone and there's that one little detail, like the little prickle on the nose, <laughs> the tilt of a laugh, the way she pronounces a certain word or a phrase, that small detail will make you fall in love with someone instantly. That's what happened to me. I remember the first time I met you. You were in red dress and a bouquet of colorful flowers in her hand, just like a princess. It was the most beautiful moment of my life. When you hold my hand for the first time, our first bike rides, you calling my name, everything was so special. You know what, now I have someone to care for, I have someone to cry for, and sometimes to fight for. How much time it will take to fall in love with, I think it just took me a second. I can't picture my life without you, everything I have and everything I am is yours. Each moment without you felt small forever.
भारत दे जय सिंह आई लव यू डू लव मी I was so happy when she said yes. Those were the best memories of my life. But good time doesn't last forever. I saw her with some guy. I first thought he might be just a friend of her, but I was wrong. Wait. I don't know what to say. Actually, The boy I saw me with hmm? was Ayush, and I think, I think I'm in love with him. Excuse me. Yeah, I know this sounds completely crazy, but honestly, I am. I was going to tell you wait, but I was waiting for the right time. Are you crazy? Do you mean listening to yourself? This is completely insane. I know, but wait. You are liar, Arden. You love me. You know it. You are lying to me. You are lying to yourself, Aradya, and I can prove it. No, Vid. What's wrong with you? What are you doing? You better than this. Please, Vid. No, Vid. Listen to me. <gasps> you were doing great before I found out about you. Do you think it's easy for me to swim with another guy? No. I'm sorry, Vid. Please try to understand. No, I am sorry that I made you. I am sorry that knowing you has made me question everything. But Aradya. You are the one that made me feel most alive, but I am not sorry that I am in love with you. I am not. I think we need to take a break. You are right. Let's cool down and take a break. No, break from us. Hey. 
Hello? Ardhya? Why don't you call me? Why are you trying to end up everything? You are the one who's ended it. Yeah, because I was mad at you. Not because I stopped loving you. I want to meet you. Restaurant 5. Please come. When you proposed me, I didn't feel the love, but I thought there was a hope. You and I, we had something, an understanding. I thought spending some time with you will make me fall in love with, and you were alone and lonely. I didn't want it to hurt you or to see you unhappy because of me. That's why I said yes, but I was wrong, and I know my betrayal hurts you. I failed you. I'm sorry for how things turn out differently. For me, this is the end of our relationship. And for you, to move on and find someone who can really love you. I'm leaving behind my locket for her. I don't ask for your forgiveness or you to forget. I ask only you to believe me that I care about you. I really do. But, but I love Ayush. And it always will be Ayush. Aradhya. After reading her letter, I had no courage to move. I just wanted to die. But even now, I'm not exactly sure that everything is finished. There's still part of me wanted to make her smile, to make her happy, to love her. I know rage is a powerful feeling, but not more than love. Things have to fall in apart to make way for better things. And it doesn't matter if I'm emotionally weak or sensitive. I'm not going to show sad. I'm going to be a man. focus on things which will make me strong, which will make me want to live. Because I know, no matter how tightly you hold on, it's already gone.